the, the Pedros provide PR support for the uh, Afghanistan AOR. Uh, pretty much anything that's flying, or we're there to cover down on. Uh, the 16 is our primary customer. Uh, we're more we're worried about them. We watch out for them quite a bit. But we cover down on every uh, CFAC asset and then our sister services as well. If anyone's out there and they need, uh, need assistance, we're always ready to go. So we get the call. Uh, we already have duties delineated throughout the team. So my element leader, who's one of my PJs, takes, uh, takes my guys out to the birds, gets it configured and ready to go, while myself and the team leader go up to the talk. We, uh, we get the details on what's going on, figure out how we're going to execute the mission. Once that's done, we come downstairs, grab all our stuff, head to the aircraft, brief my team on what's going on, what the situation is, so everyone has that say on what's going on, and then we get on the aircraft and you know execute whatever we need to do. All right, so the HH-60 is pretty much the, uh, the Black Hawk from the Army. We took it, made an Air Force variant, and it's our, our primary aircraft in the Air Force for personal recovery. We have uh, two of their special mission aviators, so on both sides they're manning the guns. They have uh, quite a depth responsibility, so they're doing everything from power calculations to making sure the uh, PJs are informed and that their gear is ready to go as well. As far as uh, my role as a pilot, uh, obviously I'm on the, on the sticks most of the time, but I also have my co pilots doing that. I'm mostly doing mission managing, coordination with other assets, and then uh, terminal area, uh, talking to the survivor. Got five PJs that I work with, and they're extraordinary at the job, and they're gonna be the ones that, they're gonna be the ones that bring someone home. Being able to multitask, I'd say, is one of the hardest things to do, just because you're having to do multiple things, worry about survivor, worry about the team, worry about the threat, worry about getting picked up or not getting picked up, if you gotta move, where you gotta move to, um, you know, injuries sustained, there's a lot of things that come into, you know, the actual mission that you're doing. Yeah, you can't put yourself in someone else's shoes. You know, I, I hope that uh, if it's my worst day, it's not my last day, and that's what we're out there to do for everyone else. Make sure that their worst day isn't their last one.